Well, current road conditions aren't too bad this morning, and that's largely due to road crews working overnight and into this morning. Hundreds of miles worth of mid-Michigan highways and major roadways had at least one pass through by a snowplow truck since yesterday spreading salt. And so joining us now live outside is 6 News reporter Autumn Pitcher. How's it looking out there, Autumn? Good morning, everyone. Lansing got about two inches of snow last night, but as you can see, a lot of that has melted over already. I wanted to give you a live look at the roads last right now. As you can see behind me, they are very slick, so make sure you are staying careful out there this morning. But while some areas are slippery, Lansing and Ingham County have been distributing salt since yesterday afternoon and throughout the night in needed areas, especially on major bridges where they say it's the most slippery. And with a snowier than average winter projected, city officials say they're prepared with supplies. I spoke with Ingham County officials who tell me they have 50 plow trucks available for use on county roads. Lansing officials told me similar as they're also stocked up with 50 trucks and typically send out 10 to 15 for a lighter snow. Now when it comes to salt, last year Lansing used almost 7,500 tons while Ingham County used 16,000 tons. But neither are worried they'll run out for the snowy winter season projected. But if it does turn out to be a heavier winter than past years, we, we would have to order more sand and salt. Um, but at this point, you know, all of our salt domes and salt sheds are all full and we are ready for any snow event that we get. Now, officials say to make sure you are driving a little bit slower out there this morning as the roads are still slick and also make sure you give space between you and the cars surrounding you in case you do need that time to stop. Here for you live in Lansing, Autumn Pitcher, 6 News.